What's up guys, welcome to KC Unlocked. My name is Drake and I'm here to guide you through the world of access control. Let's get into it. Today we will talk about wireless locks, their benefits, and the installation process. This is a wireless lock. Wireless locks are installed straight into your door, just like any standard analog lock. The only difference is that they have some added electronics built in. They are usually battery powered and they connect to the internet via Wi-Fi. Kisi has an integration with Allegiant wireless locks, bringing the power of the Kisi system to the convenience of wireless locks. Wireless locks are very easy to install, sitting right where a normal lock would. Like the name suggests, it is a clean, wire-free lock. No wires need to be run. With a lock like the Allegiant Schlag NDE, you can connect to the Kisi access control system and harness all the benefits that come along with it. The main benefit of wireless locks is their ease of installation. You usually don't need to drill into your door or the frame. They are also, obviously, wire-free, making it a good-looking solution. With Allegiant wireless locks, you can connect to the Kisi system, taking advantage of everything it has to offer. For this installation, you will need a Kisi Controller Pro 1, an Allegiant Schlag NDE wireless lock, an Allegiant Schlag GWE gateway, and a small flathead screwdriver. Note that the Kisi Controller Pro 2 does not currently support wireless locks. Be sure to unplug the controller before wiring anything. First, you will need to wire the gateway to the controller. Identify the RS-485 ports on the bottom left side of the controller. Wire the GND port of the gateway to the GND port of the controller. Wire the TX negative port of the gateway to the A port of the controller. Finally, wire the RX positive port of the gateway to the B port of the controller. Connect the gateway and the controller to power. The order in which you do this does not matter. Now let's set up the software. To begin connecting wireless locks to the KC system, they need to be registered through Allegiant Engage. Follow the guide in the description to do that. At this point, the gateway should be wired to the controller, everything should be powered on, and the gateway and the wireless locks should be visible in the Engage mobile app. Now sign into Kisi. Navigate to Places and select the place you want to configure the wireless lock for. Click on Doors, Add Door, and define the name for your new door. Click on Add. Navigate to Hardware in the left-hand menu and select Controllers. Select the controller that has the gateway wired to it. Scroll down to the list of inputs. If your wireless lock is connected, it will automatically appear there. Select it. Under Search Door, select the door you just created. Click on Unlock Duration and select how long you would like the door to remain unlocked after credentials are presented. Click on Save. You can now control the wireless lock with the Kisi system. If you found this video helpful, be sure to leave a like down below. Smash that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay up to date on the latest in access control and physical security. Leave a comment if you have any questions and we'll try our best to get back to you. Thanks for watching.